Look how clever and complex this statement is, and I want you to see the data. We actually have two partitioning statements here. This is not a multi-level partitioning. This is different. We're taking all 2005 orders to 2009 orders, and we're partitioning with each interval one month. Then we're taking our last year, which is 2010 data, and we're going to partition that each day. It may be crazy, but you can see here we've got 2005 data each month. January, February, March, it just keeps going all the way down to 2009 to the very end of December. Each partition is one month of data spread across those amps. But then when we get in our last year, 2010, each and every day is a separate partition. The parsing engine knows this, so if you're querying older data, it knows that that's partitioned by month. Anything queried in 2010 here, the parsing engine knows, hey, those are partitions per day, and it's going to guide the amps on exactly what to get. The parsing engine knows all, so when you run a query that says select everything from the order table, where the order dates between January 1st, 2010, and January 7th, 2010, the parsing engine knows that the 2010 data was per day, and it's actually going to come up with a query that says, I'm going to do an all amps retrieve from seven partitions, and it's going to be very fast.